What's going on guys and girls? It's Zach from Switch Force and we are back with another new Switch game because despite what you might be hearing on the internet, the first half is pretty loaded for Nintendo and our trusty Switches. Hope you guys are all having an amazing time, staying safe, staying healthy, staying happy out there. This is the full game of Bravely Default 2, another one of Nintendo's February releases and a JRPG that has a lot of jobs. Uh, but hopefully it doesn't feel like work. The reviews are actually quite strong, so I'm super eager to see what we think of it. We're going to be diving into the first few hours together and exploring. If you guys enjoy, hit that like button. Let me know if you're going to pick this game up in the comments down below, and do not worry. Uh, there obviously are a lot of Switch games coming in the second half of the year, so if for some reason you're not a fan of Bowser's Fury, Brave the Default, Monster Hunter Rise, New Pokemon Snap, Skyward Sword, Mario Tennis Super, or Mario Golf Super Rush, like, there's still more coming, but let's dive into this. Good morning, everyone. Hope you guys are all starting your days off wonderfully. Got that tiny Animal Crossing update last night. Itty bitty living space. Um, but, you know, some people have already hacked it, so on with the show. This is the full game, yes. The full, full, full game. The one that costs $60. The one that you download from the eShop or pick up from your local favorite pile of bricks. Should we do voices? Maybe it's voice acting. I think it is. I am that which whispers, which carries, which connects. This thread of life, adrift, untethered. It must be woven back into the fabric of the world. Remember. Remember who you are. Oh boy, who are we? What's up, guys? How are you guys all doing? Morgan, Steph, Ian, Jenna, Brianna, Emma. How is it going? Um, oh gosh. Do we have a red aura? A yellow aura? Or a baby blue aura? I mean, I love baby blue. I think I look pretty good in blue. And I also like this pinkish hue, but we'll go with normal. Kingdom Hearts! Oh, give me those vibes. Return to the land. To your destiny. Dude, it's pretty hard to cry when you're locked under the, the land like that. This guy's name is Seth. I mean, Seth is a fine name. I'm trying to think, do I have any Seths? I don't... Oh, I do! Seth! He was a soccer player when I was in 8th grade. He was very popular. People really liked him. I don't know. He was just a good kid. Just a nice guy! <laughs> Alright, some characters will not display correctly. Well, that's fine. Zach is plenty of appropriate characters. What's up, Mason? How's it going, Laura? The inner ocean's call. Not the outer ocean. It's like any belly button, outy belly button. Most of the ocean is in inner, but some, some's outer. But the inner is where the good stuff. The most delicious lint. Ew, gross, sick. Yuck. Teach me how to bravely and how to default. The battle system is where the game gets its name, if you did not know. Um, this series originated on handheld, and now it's home console, but they kept the same look and characters, which is a little odd. That's the main complaint I've heard, but the game's got like straight eights and nines, so pretty pumped. Little tiny chicken boy stuck on the sea, washed on the sand. Ooh. Nice beard. It's like Gulliver. It's like a, it's like Animal Crossing, but with humans. This is what it'd be like if Gulliver was a person. Uh, where? Oh, he's gonna talk. Where am I? Is this, is this what, what the crystal, crystal wished to show us? Without, Without a doubt, doubt my lady. lady. Where, Where the light, light led, led, there he lay. Are those voices? But whose? Twould seem he is a young man of the sea. This is all a little unexpected, I must say. But I trust you, Sir Sloan, and I trust the light of the crystal. He may not seem much, my lady, but appearances can be deceiving. In any case, he is in need of urgent treatment. Let us return to town with all haste. 
We will talk more of what this means at a later juncture. Can't believe I survived. It's like the Dark Crystal. The Crystal tells us. Take him to town and fix him up. The injuries are plenty. The beard, though. You can't stop the mic of that big beard. I mean, I don't think the graphics are that bad. People have said, like, oh, it's kind of a, an issue, but so far, so good. Yes, Pokemon Direct tomorrow. Logan, I'm pumped for it. What's up, Diego? The, the painterly backgrounds are just gorgeous. Absolutely delicious. Look at it. It's like a picture book. It's like a little Pixar person got dropped into, you know, Hansel and Gretel. It's really cute looking. Huh? Where... Where am I? You are in Halcyonia, in an inn. Don't be alarmed, you are quite safe. Halcyonia, that's a cool t I I'd move there. Now that you appear to be capable of speaking, perhaps you could tell me a little about yourself. Me? Uh, sure, I mean, <laughs> I'm just a regular sailor, I guess. My ship got hit by this huge wave, and I was swept overboard. I... I don't remember anything after that. Guess I must have drifted here on the tide. It is so shocking to see voice acting in a game that, like, used to be a handheld title, and that... You fully expect to have to read all the dialogue? Like, muchos gracias. Appreciate the support, Square Enix and Nintendo, for doing this. Localized, lovely, and so poignantly. Thanks, Puzzle. Then perhaps it was the Crystal's will after all. Huh? What do you mean? Yes. Ah, our young seafarer has awoken at last. This dude is like the most generic old man ever, but I love it. Verily, thy plight has Verily. troubled us greatly, friend. We had feared the very worst. Verily. Next time your mom's like, do you want food? Verily. Hey, you gonna play Animal Crossing Switch with us tonight? Verily. Thy plight hath troubled us greatly, Brewster. <laughs> this is Sir Sloane, the royal man-at-arms. He does look like he's about 12. Hey, he's probably like, look, I look like I'm 12, but I'm 31. So I think, uh, I think this boy is probably pushing like 23. The what? Come, my lady. We must make haste. It will not do to keep King Vernon waiting. Indeed not. We will leave right away. Wait, you're going to meet a king? Who exactly are you? I want to just stick a carrot in his mouth. It's so small. Gloria of Musa, ah, at your service. Gloria. Princess Gloria of Musa, if you prefer my proper title. Although, since my kingdom was destroyed, I've been unsure whether I'm worthy of it any longer. <laughs> You're a princess. Dude, she's fine enough to be a princess. Come on now. Come on now, Zach. I shall explain everything in due course. For now, you would do well to rest a while longer. Uh, sure. Okay. The, these people take me to their kingdom and they just want me to take naps? What a life. What a life, guys. What a life. All right, it's time to get your adventure underway. Any key locations you need to visit in order to move the story forward will be indicated by la da da Why not start by seeing where it leads you? If you ever get confused about what you're doing or where you're supposed to be going, you can always hold R to check on your current objectivos. Cool. Oh gosh, look at my little guy. Boop 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 boop. I bounce around like I'm literally in a dollhouse. But these tra look at those transitions. It's like a little book. Okay. No, I not not many mouths. Feeling better now, are you? Uh, yeah. Thanks for letting me stay here. Don't mention it. It's only right to help people. I like the voices. Well, thanks all the same. So this place is called Halcyonia, right? Can't say I've ever heard of it. W where exactly are we? Wait, do I have a ponytail? You're kidding me. 
Ah, oh, I didn't think you were from around here. Look at these cute maps, right. man. Let me show you on a map. Uh, here we are. All right. What the? This map doesn't make any sense. Where the heck am I? See, this is what happens when you wake up underwater. Clearly the dude is having like a strange hallucination. Halcyon, he's, he's on Halcyon. What's this? Isn't that, isn't it called Halcyon? What's the stuff they give you at the dentist if you're like really freaked out? They give you like a pill so that you like don't, you're kind of like out of it slash asleep. I heard you met with something of a calamity. Yeah, I guess you could say that. My ship was hit by a giant wave. Must have been a freak storm or something. I think so, Kareem. I'm surprised, but I think so. Oh, dear. Yes, we've been hearing a lot about enormous waves and the like lately. We're all right here in the city, but I heard they wreaked havoc down on the coast. That doesn't sound good. Maybe I should go check it out. See if I can figure out what happened to me. Well, the seaside's not far south of here. Follow the road out of town, and you'll be there in a jiffy. They say jiffy, 9 out of 10. Tell Instant. you what, why don't you take the map with you in case you get lost? Thanks for the map. We're really? going to go see uh, what our reflection shows, if it shows who we are inside. Boo, 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 Look at this lovely world. It's like if Disney did a little picture book. But they're obsessed with shows on Disney Plus, so that won't happen. It looks like you just bought this game. It looks like a mistake. What are you talking about, Jake? We, we've literally played 10 minutes. How would you know if it's a mistake? You'll find various helpful establishments in the villages, towns, and cities. You visit shops, inns, um, zoom around. Push and hold ZR to break into a run. Oh, I like that. Oh, you can run by default. Nice quality of life. Some games get it. Hey, little child. You might be like 30. I don't know. Do you have everything you need for our, your travels? If not, our shop should be able to help you. All right, could you go in and browse for a bit? My father gives me money for every customer I bring into the shop. Cute. I really like the looks of these places. Look at this old freaking ancient man. He's so old he won't even talk to me. All right. People, lady, ooh, nice skirt. All right, follow the, the yellow orb. Such old timey music. This is my, this is the closest I'm going to get to Main Street during the pandemic. What's up, Josh? Hope you're doing awesome. Princess Gloria, thank you for joining us. That's a stash. And some hair. Dude, it looks like these people got their hair out of, like, I don't know. Like, they made it out of string. It's kind of freaky. I think you may have some inkling of why I have summoned you here. It concerns the future of the Musen Royal Line. It has been three years now since you came here to our kingdom. And while I can only imagine your pain at having lost your realm under such tragic circumstances, there comes a time when one must turn from the past and begin to look forward. I wonder if you might consider making your stay here a more long-term arrangement. Prime Minister Horton has convinced me that in finding you a suitable match, we might sooner bring about the restoration of your kingdom. Prime Minister Horton looks like he is up to no good. That is my early candidate for Villain of the Year. Has he indeed? Thank you, Your Majesty. Yes, with King Vernon's permission, I have instructed my heralds to canvas potential suitors for you, Princess Gloria. Um, Logan, it, it, you know, you'd have more background of the, the whole game world and all the lore, but you can totally just play this, like, fresh. You don't need any past knowledge. Muse's unfortunate end need not mean the end of its illustrious line, after all. I see. And have you any thoughts on the matter, Sir Sloan? The honorable gentleman's line of reasoning is not without merit. Such an arrangement would indeed benefit Musa in the long term. Ah, wise words, Sir Sloan. Your reputation as both a warrior and a thinker is well deserved, I see. Reputation is a thinker. Yet I would not dream to speak for Her Highness, of course. Tis she and she alone who must decide. Yeah, Gloria, she looked like she's snoozing on this idea of arranged marriage. King Vernon, 
Your concern for my well-being is, as ever, far more than I deserve. Put him in his place, Gloria. You got this. Alas, I have a sacred duty to perform before I can even begin to consider such worldly affairs. Beautiful. This being so, I am afraid I have no choice but to respectfully decline your suggestion. A powerful 21st century woman at your service. What? How dare you treat my... I mean, King Vernon's kind offices with such disdain. Why, a match has been all but agreed already. Do you wish His Majesty to look a fool? That will be quite enough, Horton. We have no right to expect anything of Princess Gloria beyond her kindness in hearing us out. We are friends and allies of long standing, and her wishes will be respected. If it is not impolite to ask, Your Highness, what is this sacred duty of which you speak? I kind of want to just reach the into the screen and grab these little people. They're like little figures. My kingdom's greatest treasures, the four crystals. <sighs> That's not how you say. It. You say, "Hmm." Come on, Horton, get your voice acting better. What's up, Ian? Yeah, the, the reviews. I was shocked. They're really good. There's some tens, a lot of nines, and a lot of eights. Nothing really below that, which is freaking great. Fortunately, thanks to Sir Sloan, the wind crystal is safely in my possession already. But the whereabouts of the others remain unknown. I love the little details. Like you can see how Sloane's outfit is very like dirty. Gloria's is all glitzy. And then my boy over here, Sir Horton, dude, he just stroking his freaking stash. Love that. <laughs> Gotta appreciate the little details, okay? And that does not bode well. Fire, water, wind, earth, nature's masters. The crystal's power exceeds the hand of man. And if unleashed, would bring down death, disaster, calamity, and blight upon the land. I learned those lines as soon as I could talk. And if I understand them correctly, the troubled seas may be merely the first among many calamities to come. It is my duty, no, my destiny, as Princess of Musa to do all that I can to prevent further misfortune befalling our world. And I shall fulfill it. Let's go. Very well. I understand completely. Princess Gloria, you must go. You must fulfill your destiny. I like how this king is like, okay, fine. You can go and fulfill your destiny. I won't force you into marriage in our strange, uh, you know, picture book town. Thank you, King Vernon. Your understanding in the matter is much appreciated. Dude. Horton yeah. is pissed. All right, now let's get, like the, the highlight of Braille Default, if you're not aware, is like the battle system. The battle system is very good. It's very fun. And um, we hopefully will get to battle today. All right, beyond the city limits. When you're out and about in the field, it's a good idea to take a look around. La-di-da-da. -da. Okay. <laughs> oh, dude, okay. You can save your game at any time. You forget to save the handy auto save. will occasionally save. Get in the habit of saving. Thank goodness for our sword, man. All right. It's a little bit of action here. Um, no random encounters in this game, which is quite good. Um, but we can, you know, live action chop. A few. Can we chop the trees? No, we cannot. Trees are too strong for me. Um, we got our... Oh, look at that nice fast-paced run. We can move the map around, bring up the mini-map, and show where we're headed off to. We can... Oh, look at that. Full rotation on them. Okay, yeah, back to the sea. Uh-oh, there's a crazy witch. Whoa. It's terrible, isn't it? Uh, yeah. I mean, I heard it was bad, but... This is something else. You should have seen the size of the waves. They smashed absolutely everything to pe... <gasps> Ooh, battle time. Dude, I like this. Look at this monster design. It looks like it really does give me Zelda vibes. Straight out of Zelda. 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 It's my new game. A monster! Quickly! Get out of here! Let's go, Moblin. It's time to duke it out. And test out okay, what this game is all this. about the combat. Oh, my sword got so much shorter. Dude, why'd they swap out my cool sword for such a short it's one? My turn. All right, two commands from the key components of the battle system. 
Uh, we got Brave and Default. Use Default to accumulate build up power. And Brave to unleash it. Brave. The Brave command has a potent offensive technique that enables the character to spend BP in order to increase the number of actions they can perform that turn. You can use it to string together chains up to four moves using an item then attacking three times, for example. It's even possible to borrow BP against future turns, enabling you to pile on the pressure when the time is right. The default command is a powerful defensive maneuver that enables the character to hunker down and tank, bank, their Brave points. Okay. Alright, send a trap for yourself. You don't currently have any BP bank, but you can borrow against the BP of future turns. This may not be the best, but never mind. Try it for now. Tracing Brave to perform some attacks. Okay. Alright. Wait. Okay, I think I have to... Okay. Where do I need to move myself to see? Okay, we're gonna go... Uh, a floating head. I'm gonna be right here. I know this looks like I'm floating, but it's where I need to be. Um, I miss future turns. Oh, wow. Alright, we're going... Braverama here. Um, goblin B, Goblin A. Probably B. And then uh, A, and then B, and then A. Nice. Quick. I love. Look at the backgrounds. Like the backgrounds are really, really nice. Thanks for the tiny, tiny attacks. Okay. I gained back a little, then he's doing Bash Rush. Why does this have better battle graphics than Pokemon? So yeah, so I sacrifice so they get a lot of turns in a row. Okay, what's the, plan? the key benefit of the Brave Command is that it lets you perform multiple actions in a single turn. Be aware, however, that if you borrow BP against future turns, then the deficit. Wipe the enemy out in one go, and you'll have nothing to worry about, but it's worth bearing in mind the risks if your gamble doesn't pay off. Okay. All right. So if I default here, how much? Okay, we we can't see how much attack they have, right? Examine, and yeah, we have no idea. So let's default. Well, what? Crikey! Sorry, pal. I didn't see you standing there. How many times have I told you? Look before you cast. You can't just jump in spells blazing. And how many times have I told you? I can't believe it's fully voice acting. Guy. He's alright, isn't he? Don't sweat the details. Someone has to when you're going around nearly frazzling people. Dude, look at this girl's hips. Holy cow. Are you alright? Uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> but uh, who are you exactly? Just a couple of concerned passersby. This guy's a wandering scholar, and I'm the one he hired to try and keep him out of trouble. The name's Adele. Oh, and I'm Elvis. Dude, I I wonder what these guys did after their musical careers. Adele and Elvis, what a group. Anyway, enough chit chat. We've got a battle to finish. Try not to incinerate anyone, okay, Elvis? Hi, aye, aye. I'll do my best. Hmm. All right. So, gosh. Should I be up here, maybe? Okay, I'm gonna make myself a little smaller. I'm gonna just float in the corner, I guess. I'm like the omniscient god. Like, hello! This picture book world, I created it of my own two hands. Two. Alright, so... Let's just attack. I don't really... Th wow, these guys have a lot of... A lot of health, man. Why did I not get to attack that turn? There we go, finally. Guess it's my turn. Okay, finally my dude gets some attack. Oh, nice, critical. Right. Let's see. Vulnerable to swords. Beautiful! Freelancer, Black Mage, Freelancer. Jobs are a huge aspect of Bravely Default 2. So that is going to start playing into its uh, into the whole systems uh, very quickly. And in a scrap on you, laddie. That was some tasty brawling. It really was. You were definitely more help than a certain so-called scholar I could mention. Oh, aye. Less of that. 
I pulled my weight fair and square. Isn't that right, pal? Huh? Oh, um, yeah, definitely. Oh, you're only saying that because he put you on the spot. It's all right, you know. You can tell us what you really think. Besides, if you're nice to this one, it'll only go to his head. <laughs> and what would be so wrong with that, eh? Go on, son. Praise away. I could do with a wee boost to the old self-esteem. A boost? <laughs> Their accents are almost as good as mine. Thanks, Emma. I appreciate that. I'll take that as a compliment because I like the accents in this game. What's up, Tomo? Um, Steve, yeah, that's the big complaint with Bravely Default 2. The reviews have been really good, but yeah, you gotta kind of stomach the graphics. Um, they're a very interesting art style, we'll say that. Believe me, that's the last thing he needs. Uh, anyway, thanks for helping me out back there. Uh, miss. It's very odd that they didn't choose to, like, bolster the models, bolster the look, but I think they just wanted to really keep it consistent with the handheld games. Um, the Pokemon Presents tomorrow is going to be 7 a.m. Pacific. 7 a.m. Bright and early descendant. Hey, less of that. It's just plain Adele, okay? Aye, we don't stand much in ceremony us two. What are you doing scrapping with monsters anyway? You don't look like your average warrior, I must say. Oh, I was just helping out an old lady who was in trouble. <laughs> ah, have a go hero, eh? Very noble. I reckon you and me are going to get along just fine. Uh, which is lucky, because I'm about to take you back to town and treat you to a wee drink. Oh, really? Are you sure? Am I sure? <laughs> After a bonding experience like that, I insist on it. Well, in that case, all right. That's the spirit. Ho <laughs> ho! Then away to the tavern we go. I've worked up a right old thirst. Oh, but before I forget, have you seen one of these about the place? What is it? It's called an asterisk. Us two are on a journey collecting them, which is how we ended up happening across you. But we're not friends or anything. I'm only here because he hired me. Ah, guy, details. Anyway, we heard there was someone around these parts in possession of one of these wee beauties, so... I was wondering if you may know something. His asterisk kind of looks like a dice. These characters shouldn't be able to drink. You know, yeah, I agree. They all kind of, they kind of all have baby faces. I mean, maybe this is the world I belong in. Looking so much younger than my years. No. Sorry, guys. I'm not from around here. Matter of fact, I'm not even here by choice. I got shipwrecked and just kind of washed up nearby. A shipwreck? Talk? Yeah, I guess. But hey, I'm still alive, and I wasn't too badly hurt, so... Aye, sounds like you're plenty to be thankful for. Not least of all meeting the two of us. Now, shall we go and celebrate or what? That bar won't prop itself up. Mmm, <laughs> baby. This is Link when he's old. That guy right there, by the way. Your Highness, a wandering merchant brings most worrisome tidings. The desert kingdom of Savalon is beset by a sudden abundance of water. So much so that full half the capital has been submerged. A deluge in the desert, milady. Tis unheard of. I would fain hazard a guess that this is a crystal's doing. Savalon? The kingdom is a muse and ally of long standing. And King Orion is a fine man. I am sure he would be happy to tell us more about what has been happening. We should head there right away. One moment, milady. Lurk not in the shadows, rogues. Show yourselves. The hair! The hair power! It's very impressive. Sloan. The greatest swordsman in the land is still as sharp as ever, it seems. Thou knowest me. Then thee and thy companion are no mere sneak thieves, it would seem. Perhaps thou might do me the kindness of an introduction. 
Well, since you asked so nicely, my sharp-eyed friend, I am Selena. I really like, like, yes, the characters look a little goofy and young, but I really like the variety, like, big, big guy with big hair. This girl's freaking awesome icy outfit. Like, the clothing, maybe their faces are silly. Maybe they look like little tiny porcelain robots, but the outfits are on point. Yeah, and I'm Dag. Dag. We will come straight to the point. Dad? Yes? No, Dag. Dag. Princess Gloria, we want the wind crystal. Please make this easy for everyone and hand it over. W what? Come now, do as we say, and no one will have to get hurt. Never mind all that fancy talk, Selena. Let's just bash him and take the bloody thing. They're bad guys. The old has already got one foot in the grave. We'll be done with him in no time. Thou thinkest me too old to school thee, boy. There is life in this old dog yet. <laughs> Ooh, Gramps has got a temper on him. Well, rage all you like, mate. You don't stand a chance against me. Is that an asterisk? Too right it is. Bet you wish you'd just given us the crystal now, don't ya? Bring it, old man. What? Was it you? Do the despoilers of Musa stand before me? Musa? What are you on about? Hmm. Mayhap you are mere mercenaries. In which case, whose coin hath purchased thy services? I'll show ya. <gasps> oh no! Game's up, Granddad. Put the sword down, or the kid gets it. S stop it! L let me go! Sir Sloane, you must do as he says. Whoa, that was a weird throw into the background. What kind of monster takes a child hostage? Whatever! It worked, didn't it? All's fair dinkum in love and war. Dinkum? Now shut your whinging and hand over the crystal. Whinging? <laughs> These, this vocabulary, man, I'm, I'm learning something today. Please stop it. I do not have the crystal. Hey? You have hidden it somewhere. Very well. Then we will just have to take you instead. Never! You will let the child go free? Then I will do as you say. Princess Gloria, hostage trade, eh? Yeah, not a bad idea. And I'd probably go along with it too if Greybeard here hadn't rubbed me up the wrong way. Ooh. <gasps> Sir Sloane. I really like. Fear not, Your Highness. It will take a mightier blow than this to fell me. I really like how the characters animate. So I wish they did more in these cutscenes. Like I know, like you know, a lot of JRPGs just use portraits. A lot of JRPGs just use you know dialogue. Uh, I really love their voice acting, and I love the animations. Like I think the characters look great when they move. It's just, it's just hard when they don't move for so long. Will it now? Well, there's a coincidence, because that's exactly what I was about to give you. Ready or not, your highness! I have already agreed to come with you. There is no need for further bloodshed. Oh yeah? Think you can tell me what to do, do ya? You ain't the princess of me, girly. All right, Dag. You have had your fun. But... Ah. She was telling the truth. She does not have the wind crystal. Now, do as we promised and release the child. You can walk, yes? You must fetch the wind crystal and bring it to the abandoned house north of town. Once you have done that, we will release Princess Gloria. But if you even think about bringing help from Halcyonia, well, I am sure I don't need to tell you what would happen. And chop his head off. <laughs> Smell you later, Drongo. Drongo? Gloria. <sighs> Man, so many good words that we're learning here. Man, the vernacular of Braille Default 2, this is how I want to speak. Drongo. Whinging. 
Uh, hold steel. I mean, Bowser's Fury is pretty freaking great, but Bowser's Fury is going to last you three hours. This game will probably last you like 50. Monsters freely roam the fields and dungeons of the land. Come in contact and a battle will begin. Um, charging monsters. Yes, yes. Okay, you got party chat, which is like basically these... Wait, I'm pressing the plus button. Hello? Oh, yeah, they're like these little side stories, I guess. Oh, this is not voice acted. So, uh... What? Why are you staring like that? Gosh, I need to, like, move myself. I don't know where I want to be. Maybe I should be here. Don't tell me you've taken a shine to Adele here. No, no, it's nothing like that. I was just wondering how long you guys have been traveling around. I mean, the way you fight and everything, it feels like you've known each other for a long time. How long has it been, Elvis, since you first hired me? Crikey, I'm not sure. Did we meet before I set off, or did I bump into you later? I can't quite recall. Heh heh heh, not that it matters anyway. Don't sweat the details, that's what I always say. So you don't really know each other, or... Look, you don't need to go way back with someone to know you can trust them, and that's the most important thing. You might think you'd need to know something for years, but that's not always the way. It's a feeling you have, that's all. And you've either got it or you haven't. With Adele, I knew from the start I was onto a winner, had the same feeling about you and all. Listen to your gut, laddie, you'll not go far wrong. You definitely might, but let's just let him have his thing, shall we? Heh, <laughs> sure. Alright, so those are kind of cute. Sky, what's up? We are here, uh... Battling it out with these freaking grass zombies. All right, I think this is gonna be fine. Oh yeah, dude, that pig! Oh my gosh, he's so hefty. The yellow bar underneath each character's HP MP bar is known as the turn gauge. When it's full, that means the character's turn is ready. Speed set, weight of their equipment, actions, status effects. Okay. Hmm. A warning sign next to any foe's turn is about to come around. The best to deal with anyone marked in this way. Rough guides, okay. If you want to succeed against the various enemies you'll encounter, you'll need to understand their vulnerabilities. Doing so enables you to deal up to 1.3% damage. Doshi, that's really awesome. Maybe you could message me on Discord. Um, my favorite Pokemon Tomo is Charizard or Espeon. Thanks, guys. Um, elements, weapon types, number of ways to work out vulnerability. One of the easiest to buy a magnifying glass, okay. Um, do we have any other abilities? Examine, treat. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so I can just brave off. I'm gonna brave all her future turns just to make sure we can kill Big Punga. Orc. That's an orc? I love that you can borrow against future turns, so I can just punch the big punga. Look at this guy, he's so slimy looking, I love him. There we go, look at you, Adele. I thought you could only sing, but no, no, no. Alright, we're just gonna brave our way to all of this. Wait, what are his other attacks? Oh, he's got some magic. Fire, Blizzard, Thunder, alright. I want to call it Fear Edge because Final Fantasy. Smack him with the staff. Man, this system is really convenient to get through these easy battles. I like it. What's up, Joseph? Yeah, dude, a new DK. It's it's supposed to not be retro. It's supposed to be Nintendo proper. Um, but it's I'm I'm super hopeful for DK this year. Alexander, we, we gotta wait. Oh, look at our little cute lantern. I don't know how much grinding we need to do, but we'll get a couple battles in here. We've got the upper hand, guys. We're feeling brave. Okay, everybody starts the brave point. Oh, dude, look at that wolf with his big tuft. I'm, not, huh? yeah, I'm just gonna brave. Okay, we gotta brave the wolf. Wolfie. Link Wolf. Wolf Link, sorry, gosh. Link Wolf. What do we call him Link Wolf? I hope so, Mr. Zillix. Oh, it's like freaking Dragon Ball Z. We're charging up here. I'll borrow against all future attacks so that we can smack them. Brave it up. Man, this is quite good. Wait, okay. Oh, we can up the battle speed. That's great. Look at this. Yeah, it, it is really pretty at night, huh? It's got quite a nice glow to it. Oh, no. We have no turns. Somehow this moblin goblin survived. Okay, Zack is about ready. A bash. Oh, Adele, brave it again. 
I love the speed that you like. I really appreciate that they respect my time. Uh oh, little boy Zach leveled up. Just do we get anything for that, or just stat increase? On the this guy was coming straight at us. I was like, "Well, pacha out." We've got the upper hand, guys. Hmm. All right. Yeah, it would be cool if they ran over and touched him, but I guess this is just for speed's sake, which I do kind of appreciate and respect. If we kick it even high. Gosh! Overdrive. Wow, Elvis died! Why is Elvis so weak? Goodness gracious. Alright. So, Black Mage Elvis has perished. Locked away. Okay, so... Oh gosh, he looks so sad. How do I... Okay, um... What a cute little screen here! Wow, okay, Phoenix down. Wow, I have so many items. Goodness gracious, this game is really opening up. Hi. Such cute menus. Just like in real life. Yes, yeah, stuff, right? Ian, gosh, don't tell me this. Um, miscellany. My item is a, no, that's my class. Miscellany. 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 These are, I mean, the menus are gorgeous. I love this guy's look. Look at his face. He really looks, this guy looks almost identical to the guy from Project Triangle Strategy. Thanks, Luis. Appreciate it, man. What's my travel log say? Gosh, these menus are great. You went from Halcyona to nowhere. All right. Elvis, you back. Hi, man. When it gets dark, that's when the monsters come out to belay. All right. All right, he's just saying um, that there's more monsters at night. Stay on the paths. Ooh, look at look at those little tree spirits over there. I don't think I got the sword strike in. I tried to, but... Jenna, I think I always have to go with Mario, but that doesn't mean that this is bad. It's just... You know. Let's see, what can my girl Adele here do? Kill it. Yep, good work. All right, we brave up a Zack. I just gotta keep... Elvis has, like, no resistance, because he's got 296 HP. Adele over there was 700. Um... Yeah, let's... Let's brave it up. There's just no point in not braving it up. Yeah, good work, dude. Love that, my boy. Elvis with the ka -chow. Got a monstrous fang and a stone. Have you, Sky? That's pretty cool. I haven't checked it out yet, but uh, as my poll from yesterday's Good Morning Mario indicated, I'm not the biggest fan of demos. I love how, like, convenient the game is. It just transitions your attacks to the next enemies. It allows you to speed up the battle. For a JRPG to be, like, this respectful of your time, like, I don't know. That's, to me, I think that's probably why this game has gotten as high of scores as, as it did, it has received, is just because... Um, it, it seems to be very, very cognizant of, of keeping things convenient, like a lot of quality of life. Yes, hold steel. So pumped for Monster Hunter next month. We gotta start our coverage of that, probably this weekend. Mm, alright. Coming daytime again. There was a chest out in the field. Handy hints! It's like a Nifty Gifties. Thanks, Ian. I enjoy them. It's like one of my favorite parts of the day. Looking forward to see what you guys vote on and what you guys think. <sighs> help! S somebody help me! You okay? What's the matter? Uh, a horrible man and woman took me, but then an old man and another woman came and saved me, but then the man got attacked and now he's really badly hurt. We'd better go help him out. Will you show us where he is? Whoa! Are you okay? Wait a second. You're the guy from before. Ah, uh, uh, greetings, young seafarer. 
You're hurt. We need to get you seen to right away. <sighs> Tis not. But the princess... What happened to Gloria? Is she okay? The fiends took her. <sighs> Never mind that now. Let's get you to bed. You're right. Come on. <sighs> well, I'll be jiggled. So you're the famous Sir Sloan, eh? <laughs> Lady Emma told me all kinds of wild tales about you, my man. Oh, and how is dear Emma? Is she well? I, uh... I'm afraid she passed on six months ago or so. I see. Thou wert her apprentice. Time truly does fly. Why, I can recall when the good lady studied under another herself. But forgive me, much as I would love to spend the day in fond reminiscence. Alas, there are more pressing matters at hand. I must away and rest her highness from the clutches of those unconscionable <coughs> rogues. Sorry, but you won't be resting anyone from anything in your condition. <laughs> I'd be surprised if you could rest yourself out of bed. But I must. Well, how about I join you? You are kind indeed, young sir, but I cannot allow it. The rogues in question are in possession of an asterisk. An asterisk. This music is so Disney-esque. I feel like Ariel's about to jump up and be like, Haha! I want to be where the people are. Ba -da -da -da, jumping, dancing, whatever they say, walking around with those feet. That's all the more reason to go deal with them, right? Besides, I owe you after you help me out back there at the beach. But good sir, I... I'm coming too. If there's an asterisk involved, I'm there with bells on. Thine aid is appreciated, but... Might I ask why the asterisk would interest thee so? Oh aye, ask away pal. It's because of this old book, see? I found it when I was going through Lady Emma's stuff. I couldn't read a word about when I first picked the thing up. But we've an asterisk near it, and the gobbledygook starts making sense. Hmm. And I'm nothing if not nosy. So I set out on a quest to find enough of these special wee stones to read the whole thing. Intriguing. If I can find another asterisk and help your pal into the bargain, then everyone's a winner. Great. Then we should leave right away. Though it weighs heavy on my conscience to enlist the aid of strangers, I fear I have little choice. You have my thanks. Her Highness has been taken to an abandoned building north of the town. Let us make haste. Sir Sloan is now accompanying the party. All right, so we got a nice little uh, quartet all of a sudden. What's up, Benjamin? Send it. It's got really good reviews. I mean, we've played like 50 minutes, so I don't feel comfortable like telling you if it's like worth it or not yet, but Sometimes be joined by other characters during the course. You'll be able to control them. Oh, they're just guests. Just hanging out What's up, Labby? Thank you so much. You can use tents out in the field and at save points in dungeons restore all your HP and MP and carry any status elements. Okay Collecting asterisks will enable you to change your party members jobs Open the menu, select jobs. You'll want to strike a good balance between the roles you assign. Freelancers, depth, all sorts of equipment, black magic, sells offensive magic. Cool, cool. Alright, we ready to go. Party chat is here, but again, you don't have to partake if you don't want. Weigh yourself down more equipment you can carry, and you'll suffer the consequences. Alright, here's our boy, Elvis. What's up, Elvis? First, we run into bloody Emma's old pound, then we stumble across an asterisk. The plot's thickening, sure enough. Um, oh, it's a shop. Um, a tent, please. Thank you for the tent. Take two tents. Thanks for the tents. Much love. Alright, cool. Good call, Pika girl. Um, alright, so we're heading out of town. Thanks, Jen, I really appreciate it. It's very kind of you to say. Yeah, I, I love the speed of it, Sky. Like, honestly, I don't really have the time to sit through, like, a 100-hour JRPG. 
it's just not my my life anymore um it kind of never was but i like that this is like hey we're just gonna keep it very like oh wow oh wow oh wow it's like we know what you want we know what you need give us the game let us play I don't want to avoid too many enemies, because I think that'll eventually come back to haunt us. But since we've got the, uh... Look at this, yep. Okay, we can just rave our way through. I love that our dude, um, Sloan is just like... La 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 la! And just rapid firing. Leveling up there, my boy. I kind of wish we got to pick the where their upgrade points went, but I guess the job system is what you do with that. These guys are all... Chilling like villains. Look at Sloan though. He immediately is gonna go for the attack. Oh yeah, I love the belly slapper. That's incredible. Taking a little damage, but we do gonna now. Dude, I just love that you can run through this so fast. Beautimus. Beautimus. And since we're getting the advantage, we might as well just finish these guys off. There's a couple of seconds of dark loading, you know, between um, hitting the character and going to the battle, but it's honestly not that bad. The load times seem to be thus far pretty, pretty good for a Switch game, obviously. It's interesting because, you know, I'm, I'm, I've played you know, PS5, I've played Series X, and the load times there are, like, non-existent. So it's always weird to me, like, Animal Crossing is like... It's going to take, you know, a minute to load into the game, and you're like, why, why is it taking that long? But, you know, we accept the Switch for what it is. It has some shortcomings. It's, it's the main... Oh, look at that evil bunny. Dude, bunny... I look at that vermanic bunny. What is this creature? The poor rat bit. Oh my gosh, he got bit by a rat. Dude, he's awesome looking. The character design for the enemies thus far is sick. I'm in love with that. Here I go. Brave it up. Elvis learns poison. A, hey, stick him where it hurts. Oh, beautiful Elvis, my boy. Let's go get this chest real quick. This isn't really where we need to go, but I would like a chest. A nasty surprise. Ew! What is it? Cheese whiz? Let's stay focused. Gosh! Oh, it's the rat. It's a lot of rats. Wait, what is the attack that we learned? Oh, it's Treat. At least my guy is picking up the speed with his little sword strikes. I appreciate that. He defaulted. Um, she learned Forage. Search for items. Interesting. Let's Forage. Well, we... Alright, okay, let's brave it up. So, we'll... We'll miscellany forage because it doesn't really cost anything. And then we'll attack. Attack, 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 attack. Yeah! Vulnerable to daggers, so we be good. Nicely done. Alright, I did not like the nasty surprise. A creepy rat rabbit hybrid came out of the chest. But we got some mini ethers. Ethers, ethers. Ether. What do you guys say? Ether, ether. Uther, ether. Alright. The big bong- oh, double bongo. Oh, I love that Sloan- I love that he just comes in and, like, re wrecks it right off the bat. We can go even faster with the battle system? Oh my god. I think four times is too fast. I think we gotta stick with three. But no, this is really great so far. Whoa! Watch out, guys. Okay, I gotta slow the battle down a bit. We're gonna go to three. Oh, thanks. Wow, okay. Way to heal Adele, uh, or heal Elvis, I guess that was smart business. Alright. Orc, kill the orcs. Slap them! Big pig, beat down. Ooh, smash boom blam! Um, this big wolf here should be vulnerable to my daggers. Ow. Ah. Ah! Gosh, okay, so we have to be careful. 
Um, I need you to brave it up. I need you to go magic, man. Um... Let's burn him. And then... Wait. Black magic, burn this guy, and then... Regular attack him, regular attack him. Okay, good, we got the kill there. Yes, thank you, Sloan! Let's go! No one can- Dude, Sloan is a hero. <laughs> I love that they're putting some challenge early on. Ow. Good thing you have all this medicine, man. It's making life really great. Yeah, you're done. Alright, cool. Elvis with the level up. Beautiful. Alright. Another chest. This, they can't possibly have two terrible chests in a row, right? A leather cap. Alright. I will say, there's odd slowdown when you pause the- Oh gosh, I didn't mean to do fond memories. Wait, what's his memory? Uh... Uh... Really? But he's one tough old war horse, huh? He's gotta be hurting pretty bad. Aye, the way he's strutting about the place, you never know he's on flat. He was flat on his behind not so long ago. Wait, I think he might be smiling. From an indulgence, isn't really that. The four of us venturing together, it brings back fond memories of old times. The four of us, ah, I get you, but I'm forgetting myself. Princess Gloria remains in peril. We must get moving. Shake a leg. Okay. Jesse, TBD on that. Oh, wait, are you sure you're okay? Never better, lad, never better. Ugh, as he bleeds and moans. Okay, X is the menu. Um. So can we go to equipables? Might as well give these people some caps. Um, those are all equipped. Lowers defense, but ups her weight? I don't think that's a good idea. She's got the bronze bangle. Okay, what is the mysterious book? Oh, he's trying to do, that's the tome he's uncovering. Um, can we, can we heal out of battle? Interesting, gosh, the menus are really, really pretty. Um, okay, so he can treat. Wait, we can't. Can't do it out of battle? Okay, interesting. Have a great day, Jenna. Yeah, it does remind me of support from Fire Emblem Sky. You're Let's quite right. This. No, I like the comparisons, Peek. I think that's really nice. Not, huh? Why would you not... I guess would, is the reason that you would not brave is just to... Like, help me out here, Pika. Is the reason that you would not brave is so, like, in future battles you could use, like, more defense and stuff? Or why... Why would I not just brave every single time? Like, take four turns, lose four turns. Is there any benefit to, you know, having one than the other? Or is it just, should I be braving constantly? What's up, Mina? We're just playing Bravely Default 2. We've been playing for about an hour. Um, can you give me any tips on that, Pika? That'd be awesome, since it sounds like you're pretty... Good pretty pro at the franchise like i guess it's just so i have more ability to swap between targets and uh you know what use defensive moves or heal in between i guess the way doping gets stuck in. my boy sloan with the swipes of doom yeah thus far it just seems like brave all the way Definitely too easy, but we need the XP that we'll take. And we got a Dwarf's Tooth, which is cute and also kind of creepy. Also probably very smelly. What is that? Oh, those guys look... I think they're red because they're too high level for us. A nice tent up here. Guessing we can rest up if we need to. Sloan, of course. Slapping. Um, I played the first game a decent amount, Adri. Uh, not Bravely second, though. Hi, lady. Guy. Want to hear something interesting? A little bird tells me that undead monsters can't cope with healing magic. Huh. 
Healing undead monsters. Oh, you never have too many tents with you. All right. Wait, can I stay in your tent or... No, you guys, okay, you guys, that's just your tent. Cute. I love that you have a tent. Oh, this is the house we're trying to head to. Interesting. I hope we get to fight Dag. So what's the plan? Princess Gloria is being held hostage, right? Indeed she is, fair maiden. It will be necessary for me to enter alone and begin negotiations, lest the brigands suspect foul play. However, at a suitable juncture, I shall create a distraction, allowing your merry band to swoop in and rescue her highness. A distraction, eh? Uh, and how do you plan to do that? With this. It is a sorcerer's stone that upon firm impact emits a most dazzling light. Ooh. I shall cry out by the light of the sun, and by these words shalt thou know to enter. The princess knoweth well this praise. Tis one we have long since settled upon, and by it shall know to close our eyes full tight. Uh, Cat Quest, the Pokemon presentation, the Pokemon Direct is in 23 hours. One, 24 from one hour ago. Bye, Kiki. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you for stopping by. Nice. So we just wait for the signal, then it's go time, right? Precisely. I shall be counting on you. To fight or to flee. There are a couple of ways. Uh, what's up, Scotty? Finding out if a monster face can be dealt with. Red glow. Both of... Both of these mean you're a little underpowered to be facing that opponent. Might be better off avoiding them. Yep. Like I predicted... Look at, I mean, the environments are really pretty. I don't really care about these party chats, but... Praise the princess. Thou seem somewhat anxious, lad. Twere better than thou would call him. Vexation doth do the sword arm after all. I know. <laughs> right, Nedry? These heroes will never learn. Fret not unduly on Princess Gloria's account, her highness is a good deal hardier than she might at first seem. Twas e'er thus why I remember when she was but five years old. Zephyr, a fine steed, for whom the princess had developed a surprising fondness, or surpassing fondness, lay ready to breathe her last. Ah, she was a wondrous creature, as gentle as the breeze for which she was named. And she died just the manner she had lived, simply closed her eyes and made as if to sleep. The princess, who had attended to every moment of her dear friend's passing, spake such fine words when the moment came at last. Enjoy your rest, Zephyr, and do not worry about us. We will miss you, but we will always treasure your memory. For one so young to put a companion's feelings before her own in such a manner. Wow, and she was really just fine? Indeed she was. At first I thought perhaps she knew not what it was to die, but no, soon enough she set about weeping. She knew right enough, knew all too well. It was at that moment I saw for the first time just what a kind heart she possessed. Oh, one so precious must be kept from harm at all costs. Don't worry, we'll get her out of there. You'll see. We will indeed, lad, by the sacred oath that made us a servant and protector. Beautiful, beautiful. I can't rotate the screen, but I think there's a mo Okay. Hey, you. It's a little hat creature. What is this? Look like it has a hat. Let's do this. We feeling brave. Oh, yes. Magelings. Okay. Slap the magelings. Wow, they died very quickly. No wonder they were running away from us. I'm amazing. I would have ran away too. Alright. It's a very big building. Holy cow, this house is mo look at this. I love the little lantern light, it's so the mage lane. A chest that could be evil. Teleport stone. I'm guessing that. Thanks, Jesse. I'm guessing that teleports us back to base. Like back to the town. Alright, let's slash and crash. We lost Sloan because he's going to go negotiate or whatever. Peace out. Girl Scout. We leveled up. Yes, a very big empty building.
320 PG. Might as well grab the XP off these guys. Since it's so... Ooh. Thanks for... Yeah, dude, that's what I needed. Oh! Okay, we've got a Ghost Knight here. I'm guessing the Ghost Knight is not going to be very fond of our attacks. Um, let's take these guys out quickly. Thank you, Zack. And we're going to probably have to use some magic against the Ghost Knight. Oh, unless she... Load some lunch. Yeah, her cursed our poor girl. Adele is cursed. Thanks, Mark. I appreciate it. Yeah, there's no map in here, interestingly enough. I'm gonna... Two for the price of one, maybe? I will see you on the next Good Morning Mario, Mark. Um, yeah, I think they all kind of joined forces for a bigger battle. Um, we talked about Persona Strikers a little bit on Monday uh, on Good Morning Mario. It's just another Musou, and since we so recently had Age of Calamity, I don't know. Uh, it just felt like it was going to be a lot at once. Handy hints. Nifty gifties. <laughs> Still no sign of him. Where is the use of old fat? Calm yourself, Dag. Becoming flustered at a time like this will only benefit our enemies. He almost got the better of you, it is true. But you will prevail in the end. You always do. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. And when I do, we'll have the wind crystal. And that little beauty's gonna make the both of us filthy, stinking rich! <laughs> Gabe, this game has the best hair on Nintendo Switch, okay? All right. Um, hi, Gabe. Hope you're doing well. It is a JRPG, man. A lot of dialogue. Uh, the graphics are very underwhelming, like at least the character models. The backgrounds look really beautiful. I appreciate that the game speeds up the combat so fast it kind of doesn't waste your time. Uh, but the hair is what's really, you know, there's a, it's got a lot of nines, a lot of eights, even some 10 out of 10s today. And it's, it's absolutely got to be because of the hair. You do not care that your oh, actions might bring about untold calamity. The whole thing is voice acted, which blew me away. I was completely shocked. I mean, I guess it's a home console RPG, so that should be expected. But given that this was a handheld franchise, I thought I didn't know it was going to be completely, like, entirely voice acted. Ah, pull the other one. That calamity stuff's just a lot of bulldust some drongo made up so they could keep the crystals for themselves. I'm also learning a lot of vocabulary, Gabe, like drongo. It's basically like a... A dummy or an idiot, but it's a much better word. Drongo. Uh, what other words we lose? Whinging. It's like a form of whining. Um, there are some other really great ones I forget already, though. I can assure you that it is no such thing. You have seen the state of the oceans for yourself. Does that not concern you at all? <laughs> it couldn't concern me less, you madge. It'll take more than a couple of waves to put me off making the big bucks. Oh. How can you possibly be so short-sighted? Dungeon portals. Hmm. All right. Um, what's up, Maddie? Yeah, the voices. I mean, I think the voices are pretty good. I don't know what you'd want. It. At least they're not like. It doesn't seem like they're trying to speak outside of their native dialect, which is good. I think. Um. Ooh, 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 look at this. What is this fire, Mama? Yes, let's have these hairstyles in ACNH. I agree, I would love that. Dude, it's an old man! But Gabe, look how fast the freaking combat can go, which is what I love most. Like, you can just speed through. A big one, you? Boom! And you're done. Which I appreciate. What do we got here? Everybody's feeling brave. Ooh. 
bronze goyle. I like the bronze goyles. Oh, they seem to be. Oh, I was gonna say they seem strong, but not quite. Guess it's my turn. Guess it's my turn. Doesn't even really matter where you aim because they're gonna transition the attacks nicely. Sweet, Alec. I'm glad that the, the stream made a difference for you. Hopefully it gives you something fun to enjoy until Monster Hunter, which is like one month away today. The painting doth fall in. You got an actual sword, Gabe? Okay, you can swing. It's basically Zelda. Somehow it doesn't even start as slow as Zelda. It's a JRPG, not even an action game. And it doesn't start as slow as Zelda. Oh, there were, the 3DS ones also were totally voice acted? Wow. Interesting. Dungeon Master. She is the king of this castle. All right. I love this guy. Um... Goblin Choppa. I think, Gabe, the enemy design is my favorite part of the game. The enemies all look fantastic. Wait, is Dungeon Master my job? I think Dungeon Master is the job. It's just so speedy. Lunar powered? Okay. What are these? What is this Dungeon Master technique or thing that we learned here? Let's see. Job. Oh no, Dungeon Master is an ability. Um, what is lunar lunar powered? During the night, offensive magic are increased. Okay, yay, lunar powered. Divining rod is an open treasure chest. Okay, thanks. And Dungeon Master is nullifies all terrain inflicted damage. Sure, so those are passes. I mean, I mean, I mean, Skyward Sword. I've been, uh, dude. Everybody has just been bagging on that game lately. You, you think Nintendo like put out a five out of ten? Here I go. It is a little surprising, Junior, that they haven't made a. A Zelda Switch. I, I wonder if they will for the 35th anniversary, or if the Joy-Con will be it. I really don't like the look of the Joy-Con. Uh, okay. A Gargoyle Boy coming in for the quick strike. Here I go. Um, I will say, like any good old RPG game, it does seem like in the beginning it's just like mash attack, but that was a piece of cake. <laughs> you know. Tis what it is, right? Whoa, save points! All right, so we're about to probably have a boss battle. Um, you, I do have other equipment. I have like, there's like gear. There's like uh, hats and garments and things of that sort. We just don't have a lot yet. Hear me, villains! I have brought to you the fabled jewel as requested. Now, prove that thou art as good as thy word. Allow the princess to go free. Not until we have seen the crystal. Do do do. Dag. On it. Now back, rogue. The princess. Release her unto me. First the crystal. And please, do not try anything foolish. Your precious princess will only suffer all the more. Love her outfit. Come on, Gramps. Hand it over. This guy's hair, though. <sighs> Very well. The Princess Gloria, by the light of the sun! Ah, the eyes! We blinded the pompadour! Go, go! You okay, Gloria? <gasps> it's you. Thank you. Yes. This way. Princess, thou art unhurt, I pray. I'm quite all right. 
Thank you, Sir Sloan. Can we leave the pleasantries for later? We need to get out of here. Curses. Did you really think we would not be prepared for some manner of cheap trickery? So sorry to disappoint you. And you know, we really would have let you go unharmed if you had handed over the crystal as requested. But that is out of the question now. You have upset us, and therefore we must teach you a lesson. A very painful lesson. That guy's eyeball, like one is closed and one is so barely open. Too bloody right we must. You've half blinded me here. Oh, literally half blinded. Oh, for goodness sake. Pull yourself together, Dag. I, I'll be right, boss. Just a bit blindsided by these Drongo's dirty tricks is all. Drongo! You'll pay for that! Bringo! Damn. It can't end like this. We were so... It's Crystal. Oh god, it's awakening my dragon form. Can I transform into... Truly be? A little guy? Oh, I transform into a load screen. Gotcha. Where am I? You. You who heed my call. Talking to a crystal man. Wait. That's the voice I heard after I fell into the sea. Hear me. I am wind. The sigh of the land made crystal. The wind crystal? So that thing Sir Sloan was carrying is talking to me? It is. It was I whose breath bore you to this place. But there were those who would have seen you sunk forever. Who cut your life's thread short. What? Wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me I died back there? I am. But you are here now. Your thread retied. Rewoven. My power made it so. And now it is time to choose. Embrace oblivion and allow the coming of calamity. Embrace oblivion? Or make a stand and fight oh, okay. for your survival. Alright. Should you choose the latter, you need only step into the light. This is basically Mass Effect. Who needs Mass Effect ports on Switch when we have this? If you seek the sweet release of death instead, you need only wait for it. To wrap its arms around you. If you seek the sweet release of death, that is morbid as heck. Gosh. Oh my god, I only have 25 seconds. Oh my gosh, can we get there? Can we get there in time? What if we choose not to? Did the game's end? <laughs> I feel like Solid Snake crawling, crawling through the microwave uh, section. Lies, delusions, credulity, isolation. All the absurd imperfections of the human world await you. There is still time to change your mind, to forego the suffering and surrender yourself to eternal peace. What the heck? Forget about it. We do not want to die. But no. You choose the harder path. You are bold. Courageous. This guy chose to not die. This being so, I grant my power unto you. Go forward and accept your destiny. Into the wind crystal, we send our hearts and we agree not to die. And we succumb to the pressures of humanity. All right, we got special abilities for our main boy. What just happened? What was that light? A revelation. The crystal's blessing. Whoa! And that can mean only one thing. Thou art one of us. A hero of light. Ta-da! Oh, it's exhausting being a hero. Stay focused. Yes! 
ethereal battle scene. You are ready to Fighting the cool life. outfit girl and the messed up hair man. Protect. Alright. Um... I don't know if we should brave or not. I feel like I feel like Celine is gonna need to go down. Oh yeah, shoot Celine. She's vulnerable with the bow. Here I go. Gloria going ham there. Um. Probably gonna heal Gloria. Treat her. Treat her right. Those lucky enough to receive the Crystal's Blessing and become able to perform incredible special abilities. These will differ depending on your current job, but every single one is amazing! Okay. What is it called? Somersault? All Out Assault. Oh, yes. Tap into... The Crystal. Yes. Okay. Yeah! Jedi boomerang moves. I like it. Don't get cocky, Dag. After the stunt they pulled before, not likely. I'm gonna make them pay for being so sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Times over. You right? You'll notice the music changes when you perform a special ability. That's your cue to go bananas. Your entire bony will enjoy a bonus stat boost. Okay, well, just while the music plays. Alright, we're gonna brave up with this boy. Uh, so I can black magic everybody. Um, let's poison Dag. I feel like I feel like she wants to be thundered. But just in case she doesn't, let's also burn her. And let's also thunder her again. Oh, she's vulnerable to fire. Dang it, I picked the wrong one. Curing Dag! Oh, Gloria's suffer bussing. Who is this now? This is Adele. Um. Potion up for Gloria. Let me see. Okay, the music is over. What does Gloria have? She's got oh, she got all the same stuff. We know that she's weak to the bows, so let's just go with the bow attacks. Beautiful. She's curing quite a bit. Um, well, no, let's just do one attack just to see. Yeah, no, he's not very strong. Yeah, I guess let's heal Gloria here. Really just gonna keep carrying like that? Putting enrages on? What does enrage do? It's very much hurting us. Um Oh, uh, use attack command eleven times. Alright, um, let's brave up just so we can try to get that special again. What's up, Jake? How's it going, man? The crazy cure is here. Wow. Ow. Thanks to the meds, man. Everybody's defaulting. Curing. Gosh, so much cure. Um. No, let's default. Oh, I should have saved. I should have healed Gloria. This should help. Just gonna keep, really just. How long are you gonna care for, buddy? How many? Po okay, I don't have a lot of potions left. Um. Elvis, let's brave with Elvis. Try to black magic with fire. No, I don't 
Why why can't I attack oh wait is she Hold up. Oh she like blocked herself. Okay then I'm gonna default with him. Gloria be ready. Gloria let's brave it up. Um Let's treat ourselves and then attack. Attack, attack, attack! Silence her. What does that mean? Um, Here I go. Okay, Zach. Okay. Let's get crazy with it here. Does so little damage, man. This is like that's what like 600 650 damage there she cures 450 though I, I don't know how we're supposed to win this thank you man um he'll probably phoenix down but i'll do it anyways you would have done it for me I don't think I can. I don't. I don't think I have silence, do I? Wow, okay. Are we supposed to lose here? I'm a little confused. I think we're supposed to lose. Right? There's like no way. Do I have an item that can do that? Mm. I don't think I have that. Everybody dying. Show me your health. 1500. Thank you for the Phoenix down. I guess we can't really lose. Protect! You're supposed to win? Okay. Great. I'm just gonna trust that my boy is gonna heal us if we need it. Thank you, my boy. I should just trust he's gonna heal us. So just go all out crazy attacks. Oh, I just, I need three attacks and then we can special. Oh, so I won't, I won't brave then here. I'll just brave, wait, stop. Three times, one, two, three, okay. Beautiful. His medicine is insane. No! Okay, good. She didn't cure herself. Alright, it's over. Oh, I can't. Default then. Can we attack her yet? Yes, we can. There's the cure! Alright, he's ready for the special attack. With the tango, baby! Straight from Gabe's guitar. This does like 600 damage. 690? Okay, so she's gotta be close to dying. Me with my little 1 HP oh, still making moves. No okay, and... Ah! 
I can't- I still- why can I still not attack? Oh, it's because I'm enraged to draw all the attack towards him. I got you. Okay. Well, that's fine. We'll just default. Heal everybody! 500 cure? Seriously, yo? Okay, at least the enrage is over. This is... just finish the fight here. You gotta be dead. Right here. Thank goodness! Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Salina! Oh, you drongos. Okay. Thanks for the meds. What's his HP at? Oh, he's only at 678. Great. Ow. <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, I guess this battle becomes a lot easier when you're like, I can't die. Oh, that would be nice, Adri. Thanks for that tip. I'll try that. Yeah, he's gotta be dead. This should be it. Yep, he's dead. Boss battle beaten. Thank goodness gracious. So much XP. Wowzer Bowser. We defeated it. Thanks for the help, everybody. We got an asterisk. White Mage! You got Cure, and we got Protect. White Mage supports others with the story of magic, making them invaluable additions to the party. <laughs> and we unlocked another job. An asterisk for Zaki Poo. He's become... Oh, look at that guy. Vanguard. Defang perform a physical attack on the target and decrease their physical attack by 7% for 5 turns. Stats cannot be reduced below 65%. And enrage. Guarantee the enemy's next to actually be targeted at the user. Protect the party by drawing enemy attention. Oh, basically learned it from Drongo and from Selene. Interesting. They gave us a little help, even though they were evil. Hmm. We'll get you back for this. Hey, not so fast. Wait, we stole their jobs? Sir Sloane. Hmm. Time to make a swift exit. No, wait. Sir Sloane. You're okay, right? Uh, tis not, lad. Mm, worry not. All right, let's get out of here before they come back with more of their friends. Gloria joins the party. All right, so we gotta wait. This. Um. Okay, so so blame Ferris. Is it just a lot of like attacking and healing? So the reason that you don't want to brave down to minus three is because you want to be able to be able to heal. Um. Kind of ASAP, right? Is that is that kind of the idea here? Overwrite that save. Save complete. These guys are afraid of us because we've leveled up. Um, there's a warp over here. I, I, th I thought there was. Stole their jobs. Amazing. Get me out of here. Gotcha, gotcha. So it's a lot of micromanaging the health and attacks. Interesting. Cool, cool. Oh, we wanted to see if there's an option. No, I, I keep hitting party chat. That's not what I mean to do. I mean to pause. Elvis says everyone needs to slow down. What's the matter, Elvis? Can you walk a wee bit slower? I'm absolutely jiggered. You know, maybe we should take things a little slower, not because Elvis can't hack the pace, but because, well, we only just set you free, Gloria. You probably need a little while to get the blood moving through your legs, right? Yeah. Your concern is appreciated, but I'm quite well, thank you. Alright. Alright. These people are from old centuries. And... 
slower pace so no one's left behind. Yes, Elvis. Pampered Elvis. Up your game, Elvis. Get your button gear, old man. And let's go to the options. Wait, I think options is on select. Um... Let's see. Jobs for the outfits. Yes. Control mode. Two-handed. One-handed. Quick default. Yeah, okay. Why would they have that off? That's so weird. Huh. Alright. That's so weird. It seems like such a goofy mistake to have it not be, you know... What's the word? Ugh. On L like that. What's up, man? Don't put all your eggs in one basket, yo. Alright, gotta have a very balanced team. Hey, did you see my impressive win? Oh, I was gonna borrow your tent, but alright. They're all afraid of me. Too high of level for them. Whoa, that guy, though. He is, uh... Totally all about it. Okay. I know this is not what you're supposed to do now, but, um, you know, blame. This is the, an easy battle, so we're just going for the kill. Okay, what's the plan? Kill the big bongo. Gotcha! Right? That's so weird, huh, Blame? So weird. Alright. There's the shipwreck, here's the enemies, there's the very pixelated little character models, and we're back in town. Although, let's quickly go grab this chest. Probably nothing fancy, but I'll take it anyways. Two times ward lights, okay. Yes, random encounters are a very different story. Seems like it's all about the boss battles, basically. Maybe at least early on. It doesn't look like Dag and Selena came back this way. We should be okay for now. I will not pose much of a threat without their asterisks anyway. I must take this opportunity to make a report to His Majesty. He will wish to strengthen the city guard. I will join you. Thank you all so much for coming to my aid. Hey, don't mention it. You did the same for me once, remember? Aye, and with two shiny new asterisks to show for our efforts. Mm -hmm. oh, before you go, Sir Sloan, I wanted to ask you about what you said back there. About the crystal's blessing? Ah, but of course. Tis a matter of great import, yet one which, alas, will not suffer a brief explanation. Perhaps we might speak of it upon my return. Uh, sure. I can wait. You are a gentleman. All right, eh? How about us lot go about our business as well and meet back at the inn? I have a few things to take care of myself. Very well. Until then. The party goes their separate ways. All right, talking people with blue question, blue dot 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 marks, um, side quests. Travel log gives you access to details, selecting quests, events and party chat, tutorials, okay, cool. And you guys have blue marks? Everybody's got like white marks. Such, such a pretty little town with the lights and whatnot. Hey guys, wow, so much, so much dialogue. Um, all right. Aww! So pretty! Um, there's a side quest up here. Let's check it out real quick. Hello? Oh, it's inside, I guess. Hey! I wonder where that nice young man's gone to. There's something I wanted to show him. Borrowing the boat. I get two teleport stones. Interesting. Okay. Huh. Is there voice acting for this? Hey there. There Are is. Are you alright now, ma'am? Hmm? Oh, it's you. You really saved my skin back there, you know. I'll have to think of some way of paying you back. 
Oh, there's no need for anything like that. I won't hear of it. Imagine a debt like that left unsettled. But what to give you? Hold on. You're a sailor, aren't you? Uh, I am. How did you know that? <laughs> well, you could hardly be anything else, dear. Right, come along with me. I've got something to show you. Wait, this isn't the lady with the bar bow. This is just she just showed up to say hi. They wanted me to accept the side quest, and they're like, you can now continue the story. <laughs> ah! Here you go. A little boot to say thank you. Oh, it is the old woman from the side quest. Oh, uh, no, ma'am. It's too much. Nonsense. I want you to have it. I don't get much use out of it at my age anyway. And besides, the old girl would prefer to have a <laughs> handsome young fellow like you at the helm, I'm sure. <laughs> You're right about her being old. Boat pronouns. But she's in great condition from what I can see. She's wonderful, isn't she? And sturdy as anything, too, I can promise you that. Not ocean-going sturdy, perhaps, but fine as long as you don't stray too far from shore. What say you hop on board and give her a whirl? All right, you've convinced me. Don't mind if I do? <laughs> That's the spirit. Who knows what awaits over the horizon, eh? Or who you might meet. Rob, it seems like it's worth it if you are a JRPG fan. I mean, in terms of like the nuances, it seems like it's a better or at least just as good Bravely game now on home console, but like obviously it's gonna be very genre specific. When sending the boat on expeditions, you can choose to use online functionality. Well, this is not necessary. Expeditions taken online will yield slightly better results, sure. Okay. Sack set on a voyage. Something was spotted. The wind carried the boat to the west. Land ahoy. It was stately land. Oh my gosh. What? Oh, I'm oh I'm meeting other people. Like other players. I got you. Okay. So this is just like they're like send your boat off and gather some goodies type things. I had the wildest dreams last night. Well, how did the old girl treat you? Beautifully. She sails like a dream. Which is why I can't accept your offer. She's too good to just give away. You can't? Hmm. Fine. If it makes you feel better, how about I lend her to you instead? Lend her. I'll look after her, and you give me a shout whenever you want to take her out. Perfect. Just come and find me and say the word. It's really no trouble, dear. Well, uh, I guess that would work. Thanks. Right, then. I suppose I'd better be heading back to town. Okay, ma'am. Oh, try to steer clear of any monsters this time. <laughs> I'll do my best. Thanks, lady. Quest complete. That was very, very easy. It kind of just did it for me, in fact. Stardew Valley Dreams, huh, stuff? That's interesting. Um, I'm... I'm it's supposed to be a 20 minute show. We'll probably do it live. I don't know. We'll see. This is so odd. Okay. This is all the stuff I got. It's gonna be at 10 a.m. tomorrow, right? Yeah. You gain access to a bow, earning rewards when you're not playing. 12 hours worth of expeditions. You can discover experience boosting orbs. Great way for busy people to level up. It's a cute little shop, though. Alright. Um, I think we'll pause there. I have an appointment in 15 or 10 minutes now, so I'm going to get going. A very pretty game. I mean, the character models are what they are, but the world itself and the, the backgrounds look absolutely lovely. I think it's going to be very tied to genre-specific likes and dislikes. Like, if you're a fan of JRPGs, you'll be a fan of this. If not... Not really probably for you. Um, some people may argue that, you know, they'd rather spend their money on, I don't know, 
Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury, but this obviously has a ton of content. It's just a very uh, specific, probably, like and dislike set that will appeal. I had fun thus far. Um, I will play a little more and probably bring you guys just my updated impressions once I've played deeper into the game. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate you all so much. Thanks for supporting the channel. I will see you guys all for the Pokemon presentation tomorrow. And whatever goodness comes out of that, hopefully some yummy surprises and goodies. And, of course, we'll be back with Good Morning Mario. Um, the next big game, I guess, after this is probably Monster Hunter Rise. So this should last us for a little bit. Whatever Pokemon announces and then indies and maybe um, maybe more Animal Crossing. Hopefully Animal Crossing is something fun planned for March with those uh, Sanrio cards and more. But in the meantime, oh, yeah, open the job menu real quick. Sure. What did you want to see, Adri? Um, job ability, abilities acquired. Is this what you're talking about? Is Gloria with us? I guess. So, like, we can... So he's, like, a level 5 freelancer. We can set him as a vanguard. Oh, and then we have a sub-job. So then this can be a sub-job. Um... So then, if we go to abilities here, his main is heroics, his sub is mis miscellany. Uh, we don't yet have any of these, so we can dungeon master, you know, we can do this, I guess. Then he's a vanguard. Um, and then our girl should be a white mage. With, um, I guess, Freelancer is the sub job for now. Obviously, our boy is the Black Mage. Um, Gloria, I don't know, Gloria Freelancer right now, maybe? Um, no White Mage specialities yet. He's got Lunar Powered. Um,. She's got nothing. Okay, she already got those set. Cool, cool. Thanks, Star Wars. Super appreciate it. Um, yeah. All right, that's going to do it for Bradley Default 2, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Hit that like button on your way out. Thanks so much for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay smart out there. I love you guys a lot. Until next time, thanks again, Switch Force.